Just in time to uh, visit the frost and the freezing temperatures Just outside. Just in time to freeze Ugh. again. It is brutal out this morning. A lot colder than even yesterday. I mean, we're starting off at 12 degrees in hey, Albuquerque. Coldest temperature 12, of the okay. year so far, huh? Uh, I don't know about the coldest so far this year, but it's, it's close. close to it, right? It's close. It's yeah. been two days. Oh, it was the coldest in two days. Yeah, yeah. that's the coldest this year. Of the year. Hello, ah, get it? Did you get it? You're, you're not. Come nice. on, <laughs> eat your so Wheaties, nice. Van Dyke. It's a little too early in the it's morning. Too early we need to some think more about caffeine. It, yeah. Maybe you need to step outside in the cold. It'll help wake you up. Oh my gosh, yeah, it is cold out though. Frosty too, <laughs> so that's not going to be pretty. It's not going to be very fun when you head out the door and you have to scrape the frost off in the freezing cold. So make sure that you bundle up. Temperatures will be in the teens as we go through nine o'clock. Uh, for the lunch hour, we're talking temperatures still in the 20s, and then as we go into the afternoon, highs today in the mid-30s. So uh, we're talking temperatures right around 36 degrees this afternoon. Mainly clear skies out there right now. We will continue to see. Hey, guys. Y'all are being loud over there, Matt Morrow. <laughs> I'm having to be a teacher, yes. <laughs> All right, so back to the forecast. We're talking mainly clear skies right now, and then... Out to the east, a lot of cloud cover. And uh, as we go through tomorrow, a storm system is going to move in. But this one's going to take more of a southerly track. And it's going to uh, track down uh, over Mexico. But it is going to bring in some moisture. So that south central, southeastern New Mexico, maybe getting a little bit of snow uh, for tomorrow night. So we are going to see some changes move in. But in the meantime, a frigid start this morning. And it's going to be cold all day long. Temperatures about 10 to 15 degrees below average. More sunshine, but... Uh, we're talking, talking temperatures still barely getting above freezing for Albuquerque. Keep in mind, for, for this time of the year, our highs are usually right around 46 degrees, and we're going to be in the mid-30s, so well below average for us. And then tomorrow, we'll stay with the cold weather, but again, we'll see the changes move in across southern New Mexico. As the system right here tracks farther south, it'll bring in the chance for, again, some snow across south-central, southeastern New Mexico. Not a lot of moisture, not a lot of energy with this, so we won't be talking a lot of snow, but certainly uh, that chance for maybe a little dusting down in the southeast and more snow for Ski Apache, too. Southern Colorado, spot snow today, frigid, highs in the 20s, down below zero as we head through the next few days. As we go into the weekend, highs in the low to mid-30s, so it does get a little warmer. For the northwest, mostly sunny and cold today with highs only in the upper 20s, down into the single digits for the next couple of nights. Down in the southwest, lots of sunshine, and we're talking highs in the mid-40s. Overnight lows down into the low 20s with temperatures in the 30s for highs for the next couple of days. And then we're back to the 40s for the weekend. Down in the southeast, sunny skies, chilly, slight chance for showers moving in tomorrow evening and overnight tomorrow night. Highs will be in the low 40s and back to the 50s for the weekend. North and east, sunny and cold, but warmer for the weekend. Northern mountains, a frigid all day today. 30 the high for Santa Fe, but back to 40s for Sunday. East mountains in the low to mid 30s, single digit lows. And for the metro, mid 30s for highs today with overnight lows down into the single digit and teens for some of us and our seven-day forecast showing better weather for the weekend more sunshine mid-40s and then we're talking highs right around 50 by Tuesday.